What's good YouTube? Welcome back to another video. Today you are here with Tilo and in this video I am going to be showing you how to set up your Elgato Gaming HD 60, whatever you want to call it, your Elgato Gaming Device Capture Card. Also I'm going to be showing you how to change the storage input because when you first set up your Elgato it automatically defaults to the storage you have on your laptop or computer which is generally not a lot if you're recording this from a laptop for I'm gonna do it from a laptop sake because normally people who build PCs get like a terabyte of storage and that's that's plenty. But if you have a laptop you only get like oh drop something. If you have a laptop you only get about two hundred gigabytes, three four hundred gigabytes, which is not a lot when it comes to recording videos. So yeah, I'm gonna show you guys how to do that. Because I struggled setting up my Elgato. I had to watch a lot of videos just for me to still have to do it myself so hopefully this gives you guys a clearer understanding of what you're gonna want to do so basically I'm gonna flip the camera so you guys can see that real quick Bam. all right so basically we have our Seagate this thing this is a terabyte of storage ignore these boxes these this these boxes are literally for another video so basically you're gonna want to have a you don't need a monitor but you can do this off a of TV but I'm gonna do this as a monitor. Just follow my instructions for the TV. It should still work. I have my little FIFA microphone. You don't have to use a microphone. I prefer you get one though, or else you're gonna be capturing audio from your laptop, and laptops don't do uh, don't really do a good job of picking up audio. So that's that. So basically, you're gonna. I can't unplug my stuff because I have a video recording. Not recording, but uh, it's exporting and all that good stuff. But basically, you're gonna have your Elgato. This is the outside with one port. This is the inside. You're gonna you're gonna have a cable that looks like this one. It's gonna you're gonna plug it in here, run it to your laptop or your computer. You're gonna have this one on the inside. You're gonna plug it in here. Oh, this comes with the HDMI cord, by the way. You're gonna have to plug it into your end. You're gonna run it, and then you're gonna plug it into the HDMI out. You can also do this with PlayStation. You know, then you just plug up your Xbox, and there's my extra Xbox storage. Then your out port, you're just gonna take it and run it and plug it into your HDMI port. That's the first step of setting up your Elgato. Now, I'm gonna um, switch to OBS so I can record and show you guys how that's gonna work. I'll see you guys in a couple seconds. So, once you get to your computer, you're gonna want to type in www.elgato.com slash gaming slash downloads. And it's gonna take you to this screen. Right here, you'll pick your product. I have the HD60S. And then I'm on Windows, so I click Windows. You can download 4K Capture if you want to and get into that, but I have it, but I don't use it. I have regular game capture. Uh, you would download it and install it. It's really not that hard. It takes like 10 seconds to do. This little logo right here will pop up on your screen. It should be called Game Capture HD. But before we get into this, I did say I was going to show you guys how to do external storage. So right here... In the bottom left for your little windows you just want to go want to go you're just gonna want you're going to uh, so if you're using a flash drive of like 500 gigabytes to record your videos you don't need this part of the tutorial you can skip forward to more i will put a timestamp. but if you're using a terabyte and bigger on an external hard drive that's seagate or anything else you need to watch this part of the video i'm going to put the timestamp up right now to where you guys can skip to if you're using a flash drive I'm gonna show you guys how to add external storage. So you go right here, type in disk management. Mine's already popped up. All right guys, so once you have this screen up, uh, once you have this screen up, it should, your storage should be, it should be just, it should be called unallocated. And what you're gonna wanna do is right click on it, click new simple volume, and this should pop up. Then you'll hit next, don't, bother any of this stuff because it's already set for you you're just essentially allowing the computer to use it none of, none of this matters uh new volume you can change the name to just my storage you just change it to whatever click hit finish and once it finishes it should pop up on your screen and uh it will be yeah, it'll be usable storage now. See how it went from black to blue? That means it's now able to be used to storage. So that's how you do that. 
Now, back to Elgato. What you're gonna wanna do is click in the top right corner. You can change library location and file export location, which you will wanna do. Cause this is, this is where the videos get dropped off to. So you're gonna wanna do this. You're gonna wanna change file export location and library location to the same one. I already have it set to my one terabyte storage. So I'm not gonna change anything, but you guys will set it to your external storage that you already have it going to. Hey guys, feature me here. I'm going back and editing this and um, making that last part a little more clear. When I say the one that you want it going to, I mean the uh, external storage that you just optimized and set up and everything. Do the same thing for file export location. Now, I'm gonna plug my Xbox in to give you guys a rundown. Oh, also, if you have a external microphone, you will click right here, click the external microphone you have, and right here, this blue button, you click it, and you are now capturing your audio. I will bring that back up, but that's how you get your external how to change where your storage goes on the Elgato. I'm gonna turn my I'm gonna hook I'm gonna turn my Xbox on and give you guys a rundown of how to do all that. Sorry y'all. One last thing I forgot to mention was oh my computer on this one. I'm doing too much on this one. One thing I forgot to mention was basically click right here and you can change your input. Excuse me. Your input to Xbox One, Xbox 360, PlayStation 4, and all that good stuff. That's how you get it there. And you can go in here and mess with the settings to how you want. Alright guys, now that you have everything set up, everything's done properly, right? You should be able to get your audio and whenever you finish the video, it will go to your external storage. I hope all this is making sense. This is my first time doing a tutorial style video like this, so bear with me if it's not the clearest. I am doing my best to try to do this. This is kind of like all out of my element, so I am a little shaky doing this, but I do feel like it's gonna help you guys a lot to help everybody get started off with YouTube or whatever you wanna do. But um, you're gonna wanna go to settings. I already have my settings right here because I was in the settings before. But if you don't know how to go to your settings, you just go all the way over to your profile and then you scroll down like two and then settings will be there. But once you go to settings, you're going to want to go to volume and audio output. You're going to want to change this to headset and speakers. And once you do that, it will capture your uh, you will be able to hear your friends in the party and Elgato will be able to capture your friends also. Hey man, that's it for this video. Uh, if you guys do still need help, go. you can drop in the comments what you guys need help with. I will be responding to you guys. But here's a clip of me, uh, my friends and I playing Rocket League with their audio, my audio, and everything else on the Elgato set up properly. But that's all. Keep it hot. Peace. Hey, I got to get it how I live. <laughs> I was getting to how I live. You say whatever you want to say. <laughs> yeah, yeah, off the wall. Oh, too dominant. Ooh, ooh. All right, we're gonna go. Psych. Yep.